Hey, God bless you, YouTubers out there. YouTube, Spiritual Christ, Cyberspace. May you have a blessed uh, holiday uh, for Jesus' birth because Jesus is the reason for the season. It's not uh, about Santa. Uh, you can mix uh, Santa's name around, you'll get Satan now. that. It's not by how much presents you buy you have under the tree. Who buys the most presents? The greatest present God gave mankind when Jesus come and lives in your heart. That's the greatest gift for Christmas time if Jesus lives in your heart. Because Jesus is the reason for the season. Don't you ever forget that. For the glory be to God. I have new prophetic news tonight. New prophecy. New prophecy from the throne room. A spiritual 911 here. I'm calling out here today on December the 7th, 2011. European Union. Went to the White House. They went to the White House a couple days ago. We're going to see this Bible prophecy be fulfilled. They met with Antichrist Obama at the White House, the European Union. Their president of the European Union, the New World Order, and his uh, other buddy in the European Central Bank. And uh, they're wanting to bail out from Obama here. President Obama, he is Antichrist. I'm reading in chapter 13 of Revelation that this Bible prophecy will be fulfilled in one year by next December 2012. That the European Union, the uh, 17 nations use currency in one year's time, uh, seven will drop out. And this Bible prophecy in Holy Bible in uh, Revelation chapter 13 verse 1 will be fulfilled. Here it is. And I stood upon the sand of the sea, and I saw a beast rise up out of the sea, having seven hand heads and ten horns, and upon his horns ten crowns, and upon his head the name of blasphemy. This Bible prophecy will be fulfilled in one year, December 2012. The beast here is Antichrist Obama, and the ten horns on the ten crowns of European uh, union, the 17 uh, nations today, in one year time, they'll go down to 10 nations. Seven will drop out in one year, and you'll see this Bible prophecy be fulfilled by December 2012. And this is uh, the word of the Lord God give me here on uh, December the 4th, 2011. This is God's Bible prophecy. Here it is. Coming loud and clear from the throne room from heaven, Jehovah Jireh. The God of Israel, Jesus, Savior, the Messiah. Here it is. European Union hierarchies came to talk to Antichrist Obama at the White House for Black Christmas 2011. The European Union is a new resurrection Roman Empire prophesied about in the Holy Bible in Revelation chapter 13 and verse 1. The ten horns with ten crowns are the ten nations in the European Union currency. The beast in Revelation chapter 13 and verse 1 is Antichrist Obama. There are 17 European Union nations with the euro as its currency. In one year, seven European Union nations with the euro currency will drop out. This leaves the ten European Union nations with the euro to fulfill the Bible prophecy in Revelation chapter 13 and verse 1. In front of the media, President Obama told the European Union aristocrats that their house was out of order and he couldn't help them with a bailout. That a lump of coal was in the European Union New World Order Christmas stockings for a black Christmas 2011. But behind closed doors, Antichrist Obama called Helicopter Ben to give the European Union some funny Armageddon money, the U.S. dollars to bail out the European banks. Also, a bailout of the U.S. banks to protect them from the European bank's sovereign debt coming to the USA. The three unwise men of the West, Barrick, Helicopter Ben, and Tiny Tim, are following the Wall Street greedy star of the East to destroy the American dream of prosperity. There it is right there. God's holy word, his Bible prophecy, his prophetic word. 
tiny Tim Gartner's over there now in the European Union. He's not just uh, tiptoeing through the tulips for me and you. He's over there. He's talking with the European Union New World Order. He's talking to the people in France and Germany. And he's talking to them in, in Brussels all around and, and, and Italy. And we're seeing Bible prophecy being fulfilled. And there it is, that prophecy. You'll see it done. There'll be the ten nations, the ten horns, resurrection, res, resurrected uh, New Roman Empire, which is a European Union. There it is in Bible prophecy. Watch your front page of newspapers. Every day you'll see God's word being uh, fulfilled for the glory be to God. So that's what's on my heart tonight. I want to bring it forth. Watch the news, what's going on over there in Europe. Watch the newspapers and the internet, the radio, the TV. Exciting times to be alive in these last days and perilous times. But remember, this is a time to give your life to Jesus Christ. Turn your life over to Jesus Christ before it's too late. We only got about a year left. And then next year, we're going to see some hard times. We're going to see a lot of more persecution for the Christians all over the world, especially the United States of America. We're going to see starting the market of the beast. They're getting the FEMA camps ready. U.S. Congress just sold the American citizens out that the military could start arresting American citizens without due process, without a trial, you know, throwing them in FEMA camps and prisons and jails. These are some really perilous times. Just like my last video, I've seen the dark clouds all over America. But Jesus is the light of the world. There might be dark clouds coming at the Christians, the persecutions. But we hold on to the hand of the Lord. He'll take us in the promised land, the Canaan land, the land of milk and honey, beauty land. And Jesus is going to do it. And he said, be a good cheer. I've overcome the world. I've overcome the tribulations. And he's going to help you, Jesus Christ. You've got to turn your eyes upon Jesus Christ. And say this prayer with me today and believe it in your heart. you got to believe it in your heart and confess with your mouth. And, and this will be the greatest uh, present I'll give for Christmas when Jesus saves your soul. Uh, say this prayer with me for the glory be to God. Oh, Lord Jesus Christ, I'm a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for forgiving me for my sin. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for saving my soul. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you for coming to my heart. Thank you, Jesus Christ, the Savior and Messiah. I'm born again. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. This is the greatest present I got in the whole wide world of all times, Jesus Christ. I made a decision today to accept you as my personal Savior and Messiah of the world. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. You said that prayer. Give Jesus all the praise and glory and honor. This is your miracle. This is your miracle. For glory be to God. Uh, uh, December the 7th, 2011, Jesus Christ is coming to your heart. Pray for George and Betty Kelly on channel on YouTube for us. We'll be praying for you. We give God all the praise and glory and honor that all our subscriptions. Bless the, your people out there, God, your holy people and your subscribers. Bless them, Lord Jesus, and our 5,000 plus Friends, Lord, just like you fed the 5,000 multitude, we're feeding with the spiritual word of God, Jesus. And thank you for the 2,400 churches there that were networking all over the world for the glory be to God. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for our 203 subscribers. Bless all my pray. And the hand of Lord, uh, God rest upon you this holy season. And let the power of God come down on your people. Oh, Lord Jesus, whoever sees this video, to God be the glory. Jesus, I pray on your subscribers uh, out there for me and Betty, for the glory be to God in your subscriptions and for your friends, Lord Jesus. Touch them, Jehovah Jireh. Touch them from the crown of their head to the soles of the feet. Let thy mantle fall, double portion. I pray for your Holy Ghost and power. I pray for your anointing. I pray, God, Israel, for your presence, Jesus, Savior, Messiah. Oh, when Jesus come by. And you're, you'll change. You're never the same. The woman touched the hem of your garment. Oh God, touch some people's life today. Touch them mentally, mostly, physically, spiritually, financially. Glory be to God. I give you all the praise and glory and honor. Praise your holy name. I lift up holy hands to the holy God. Thank you for the many blessings of God. Thank you, Jesus. Keep praying for at least the brethren ministry in Pinckneyville, Illinois. We covet your prayers. We thank you for the prayers. 
We thank Jesus for you. You're the greatest YouTubers in the world for God be the glory. Great things he has done. And have a blessed uh, holiday season. And I pray the ones that accepted Jesus Christ as a personal Savior today or got touched or got healed or got delivered, email George and Betty Kelly on the YouTube channel. And thank you, uh, YouTube channel, for doing these videos for the glory be to God. And all of you out there in North America and South America and Africa and Europe and Middle East and Far East, may God bless your socks off of you. The glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Turn your eyes upon Jesus. He's returning soon. There's not much time left. Thank you, Jesus, for this prophetic revelation from the throne room. You're spiritual. 911, call here on December the 7th, 2011 to tell the people what's happening in the White House. The European Union meeting the White House. Prophetic Bible prophecy being fulfilled for the glory be to God. Amen, amen.